Right, hello YouTube, welcome back to another video. This is 20IQJ. I'm out and about in my garden today and I've got a Arrow 2 antenna. It's for 2 and 70 cms, so you've got three radials for, 70, uh, for 2 meters. And 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7 for 70 cms. And it's got two aerial connections there. That's for your 70 cms. And that's for your 2 meters. And you can uh, use it for just 2 meters or just 70 cms, or both, like I've got this up here. And the idea is it's not designed to be mounted permanently, it's designed to be portable so you can take it apart. And each one of these just unscrews and you can fit it into a bag. And I've got this one from Moonraker. And we can work satellites. I've just heard my first passing of the AO91 satellite. And there's a connection down there. Just connects us to a BNC. And when you're working satellites, you don't need stupid amounts of power. 10 watts, I would think, but being maximum, you can do it on 5. You don't want to want too much power. Because what you put, uh, what you transmit to the satellite, it transmits back out, and you ruin it for the rest of the people because it loses power. If you just run the 10 watts or so, that's what we got told by our teacher anyway. When we done our intermediate course, he said, "Do not run too much power on the satellite, so you ruin it for the rest of the people. What goes in, it's got to come out." So I was like, "Okay." So I want to do a bit more research into the satellite. Hopefully, I can uh, um, work my first satellite stations. But I've just done a pass in of the AO91 sat satellite. Seven. Well, we've got here passing of the AO uh, Alpha Oscar 91 satellite. And this is um, picking up through the beam. And it disappeared. It's that way. There you go. It's flying directly above me, 